Ooh, and a B. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is The Goddess and welcome to the return of La Llorona. If you want to play this game for yourself, the link will be in the description down below. Now, I have never played La Llorona before or the first game, so I'm going to try to play the classic version. It is well known by every Mexican that Yorona wanders during the night weeping and crying over my children. This is as far as I can go with you, my child. John lies godless lands. Listen, my child, there is something you have to know about that mansion, La Quinta. You think you are so smart because you won the house on that infamous card game? But the truth is, Mr. Tuche wanted to get rid of the house from the beginning. Or do you think the owner of a casino can lose a simple poker game in his own casino? <sighs> in any case, if you continue this path, you'll find a road past a fence that lets out to town and to your new property. I wish you luck. And don't forget your journal. You will probably need it to write down all you're about to see my child. Writing can keep you sane. Farewell, my child. Farewell. Journal updated. Okay. How can I see my journal though? I don't know. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I did try the return version, but it was so bad out that I couldn't really finish it. So this is like my fourth time recording this game. So, but I never tried this one, so let's just see what this is about. What the hell? Journal updated. The zombie bite person. <laughs> you don't know. October 31, 1931. Good day, Mr. Touche. I received a telegram from Rome this morning. After our failed exorcism of the property, they are suggesting that we find objects that belong to the mother and her children, Father Guzman. Okay, this is a spooky. Oh, this is one that's so way, way better. I'm not gonna lie, how do I do this? But this one is so much better. Okay. January 10th, 1931. Good day, Mr. Tucci. I'm writing on behalf of the newspaper El Dorado. We're working on an article and we're wondering if you can confirm if La Quinta was the hospital during the revolution. Just Jesus Lopez. I think that's Jesus. Jesus Lopez. So, I guess we move on with this. Mention a page of Carolina's diary. April 15, 1930, 1931. I think I'm going to do it. There's a voice. The house is talking to me. It's telling me to do it. The house is on my side. She saw a lot during the revolution. She understands. Hmm. Was the house hunted? Here we are. Oh, this Oh, this is way more spookier. I love it. Okay. Paper. I can't take the paper for some reason. Mama! Mommy! Mama! I lied her. Okay, oh, for some reason I cannot read that one paper on the bell. Oh, this is gonna bother. Oh, oh no. There we go. November 2nd. 
1931. Dear Father, I beg you to please try another exorcism. Soon after, soon after Carolina did what she did, I got rid of everything, but some toys and a comb remind, to remind me of her and my children. Pedro to shave. So some toys. Hello. Oh, there's a toy right there. Okay, so so far. Hello. I hear something. But I don't know why I'm lighting the candles up, but why not? Right. Okay, I guess we're just going down. Yeah, oh, that's spooky. I wonder what I did not. Hello? Oh, plants. A page of Carolina Diary, January 7, 1931. Father Guzman always says that writing can keep you sane. Dr. Aguilera eh? Aguilar seems to agree. So I got this diary. Even Pedro seems to think this can help my hysteria. I hate him. I love him. Oh, I did not know that. We got a diamond key now. November 6th, 1931. Greetings, Mr. Suchet. I'm sorry, but I must deny your request for another exorcism. It will be pointless. We need the children's choice and the mother's comb that you mentioned to perform another rite. Father Guzman. Okay, so I'm assuming that we need all the toys. This is a diamond door. It is a diamond door. Oh, now we open the outside door. I'm not sure if we have anything on top. So the spade is six. February 15, 1931. Mr. Touche, I visited your wife yesterday. Her hysteria seems really bad. She was screaming she was going to drown herself in the river if you keep working so hard. I think you should spend some time with her, Dr. Aguilar. A page of Carolina Diary. March 2nd, 1931. Why does he focus on his children and not me? He spent time playing with Edgar and his stupid spinning top. And playing in dolls with Maria. Uh, it's a walk by the river too much to ask. Okay, so we got this. You know, I'm gonna write them down so I don't forget. Because I have a poopoo of a brain. So the spell is six. Here we go. Alright, I think we might need to use. Oh, yeah. I think we might need that for the combination. We don't have that, but we do have a diamond key. I'm not sure if there's a diamond door up here. No, this is hard. Okay. I guess we need a for that door. Hello? Yes, we can now reach. We got an X. Oh. It's so weird that I have to press the F to interact with the, with the items instead of a uh, click. A page of Carolina Diary, March 11, 1931. I'm having a bad thought again. I went to church and confessed all of them, and I'm still having them. Why is God giving me such a hard test? 
Uh, November 12th, 1931, father, the toys and the comb are lost somewhere in the property. I believe they are cursed. I've seen the doll move. I've heard a spinning top at night. And the comb sometimes appears on my bedroom bathroom. Pedro to shave. Alright. So now we have... Okay. I'm gonna put them back in the... Uh, house. Now that we have, um... Okay. So we're just taking the toys. Okay. January 13, 1931. Quites, Mr. Lopez. Regarding your questions, La Quinta was taken by Pancho Villa and his army during the revolution and became a hospital for injured soldier. I hope this can help you with your article. Pedro Toshe. <laughs> Girl, you're alive. Okay, so, well, the toy is not here anymore. Let me open the bag door right here. Hey, I saw you. You're not scary. No, you're not gonna me. <laughs> you're not scary. Oh, shut up. I forgot to turn on the candles, okay. A page of color in my diary, February 14th, 1931. Today he's working again. It is February 14th, and he is at the casino. He's never home, and when he is, he only pay attention to our children. I hate him, I hate him, and I hate myself. Okay, the heart is nice. All right, I'm writing everything down. This is the little shower. This could be a uh, what do you call them? A guest hall, or maybe one of the maids' chamber. Maybe. Um, why did I get in there? I didn't get anything. Right? I didn't get anything. I just got the fire. I'm surely missing something. No. It's just the heart. Okay, this must be something in here that I missed. Lighting this candle. What is that? Club is a yes one. Right, I guess we're missing one more. I'm missing a diamond. But this doesn't make any sense. I'm missing something. Oh, look at that. Diamond for it. <laughs> I, I see you. A picture of Carolina Diary, April 10th, 1931. It's been a month since the last time I wrote. I'm not fine. I'm not okay. I feel like I'm drowning in my horrible thoughts. Drowning. Like drowning in my mind. <laughs> oh, poor girl. Why is nobody paying attention to her? I don't have any more key. Uh, where's the thing? Okay. So, spade is... How do I turn it?
How do I open it? Oh, I have the wrong. Okay. Got the hard key. November 19, 1931. Dear Pedro, don't lose hope and believe in the Lord. Bury the toys and come in the secret soil near the chapel. Tomorrow you will be celebrating the anniversary of the revolution like nothing happened. Father Grossman. So we have to bury the toys, but so far I haven't seen any toys. November 29th, 1931. Dear Father, I lost La Quinta in a poker game today. I feel so relieved. I know, Father, the person won fair and square, but I'm starting to think that I lost it on purpose. Better to shame. We have a shovel. Dear Pedro, I haven't received a response from you in a few days, and I didn't see you at the revolution parade last week. Hope everything is going better now, Father Guzman. Oh no, he is dead. He is definitely dead. Hello, Dr. Aguilar. I hope you're doing fine. Carolina has been sick. She's having the hysteria again. I have to work at the casino all day. I don't have time for this. Please come see her ASAP. That's so sad. Okay, well, we have the shovel. Let's see, got a clock key. Oh. I think this is this is not her. This is her. Is it? I'm not sure. I'm not so sure. Um. Oh, we have the club key now. So, where is the door? Drum, drum, drum. Okay. Okay, we found the comb. Now we need to find the toys. Oh. You're not gonna get me. Oh, all the crosses are upside down. Hmm. I'm getting crazy. Okay, where is it? How bad is the red this? Hmm. I forgot where the other club key. I think it's like right here. Oh, and a bee. That's funny. It put my <laughs> Oh god, what have I done? I can't believe I drew my children. My hands are stained with the blood of my blood. But he kept paying them so much attention I can't continue living. Oh, uh, something gonna happen. Uh, I don't know like that. That breathing sound? No, I don't care. Now I am for sure missing one more toy. One more toy. I'm missing one more toy. I don't know where it is. Oh, wait. There we go. Let's burn it now. Now, they said I need to bury, like, bury the toys near the body, near the chapel, I think. There we go. <laughs> you don't know.
Je yorana keeps wandering the night, condemned for eternity, condemned to cry forever. Thanks for playing. That was awesome. I really like that. I really like that game. The classic one is nice, but they really need to fix the return. There's a lot of bugs in the return. Uh, for example, the the briefcase. I can't even interact with the briefcase because it just scratched the game. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to my channel for more content. I love you guys so so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!